known to his friends as Big Ben. The bell is safely installed, but its hammer proves too heavy. Two months after its first rung, Big Ben cracks. The crack still remains, giving the bell its unique but imperfect sound. One can't imagine London without it, with the river, parliament, and the chimes of the clock. It, it ticks away like Britain's heart. The sound of Big Ben fills me with pride. I think it's a symbol of what we are. Every time you hear it, you get that kind of tingle, and I do. It's quintessentially British sound, isn't it? I associate that sound and that bit of London with um, happy times and feeling I belong. It's a gorgeous emblem, isn't it? If I wouldn't like, I was looking at it recently. I thought I wouldn't like it if that got knocked over. I'd be really pissed off. It's like a beautiful thing. Not that I like symbols of imperial power, but Big Ben is beautiful. When it was built, Big Ben certainly projected Victorian power. Big Ben is a symbol of the reach of Britain, the monument standing at the centre of this global uh, empire. By 1850, Britain presides over the world's largest empire, stretching from Canada to South Africa, from Australia to India, an empire on which the sun never sets. It has acquired most of its possessions by brute force. The world's only superpower, Britain is quick to attack anyone who threatens its foreign interests. Like bombarding the Chinese coast until the emperor lets British companies sell opium to his people. We're a bit trouble, a bit of trouble really, and that's what we're known for. A little bit around the world and crushing rebellions against British rule in India, New Zealand, and Southern Africa. There's a sort of undercurrent of savagery. That hooligan nature, that savage nature, that's the element that frightens me, I think, about the British people. In the 1850s, Imperial Russia's push south threatens Britain's trade interests. To assert its authority, the British government sends an army to the Crimean Peninsula. It will be the first war of the Industrial Age.